Hello guys, I'm back with a new tutorial. Today we are gonna learn how to create true first person camera from the third person character template. So let's dive right into it. First we're gonna go into the content, we're gonna go into the third person blueprints, third person character blueprint. Then we're gonna go to the viewport and the first thing that we wanna do here is we want to connect camera boom with our mesh. Now that we did this, we will get parent socket available. We are gonna type in the head, so you can see it's a bit weird. We're gonna go to the camera boom and we're gonna select target arm length and we're gonna put it to zero. So right now we still didn't manage it to put it on our head, so we will just go here and we're gonna type zero. We're gonna put it a little bit more forward and I think this will work. So now if we want to test it, we can run. We see it's a first person, but we have a problem. When the character turns, we can see our body. So how to prevent that is, we want to go to the character movement, we want to type orient rotation, and we want to uncheck this. Make sure this is unchecked. Then we go compile, and now we can run back. But the thing is, we can still turn and see our body. So let's fix that as well. We're gonna go to the B, uh, blueprint third person character self. We're gonna type in Joe. Use controller rotation Joe. We're gonna check this, make sure we check this. And now we're gonna have a perfect first person camera. And if we look left and right, we will have just fine camera. But how to make it even more better, smoother, if you are creating some uh, adventure or creepy horror game, I think this addition would be really good, so I'm gonna show you how to do it. You're just gonna go to the blooper, uh, blueprint third person character, you will select follow camera, and you're gonna type in lag, sorry, you're gonna select camera boom. Then you're gonna enable camera rotation lag, and here you will put something that you like, you, you can just go and test depending how smooth you want, but you can see the camera is becoming really smooth and this is really good for the horror games especially. So I'm creating my horror game and uh, I wanted to share this with you. Um, teaser will be up soon, in a month or two. Um, I think you will like it. So I wasn't really active these days, but right now I'm gonna be more active I'm creating my game as well, so I have prepared the flashlight tutorial for you as well and it's gonna come either the same day of this video or really soon. So see ya later guys, bye!